Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to Mithun Technologies. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Terraform in the RHL 8. So Red Hat Enterprise Linux Server, the version 8. Okay, so for this one, already I have created a one EC2 instance. So this is the EC2 instance which I have created and it is running. So let me connect to this server first. Select this server. And also you people know already how to connect to that uh, EC2 instance from Windows machine, Mac or. So if not, you can follow my YouTube channel. There I have explained that to all the steps. So let me connect to the server first. Yeah, I have successfully connected. Just if you want, you can type it. Confirmation, the uname command. So now I have successfully connected. So I have documented all the steps and I have created one post for this in my blog. Terraform installation in the Linux server. Okay, so first login as a root user. So as a normal user, you are not able to install that uh, any of the softwares, right? So in the EC2 instance, if you want to log in as switch as a root user, sudo su hyphen. Okay, so we have switched to the root user. Then you can upgrade all the packages in our server. Before installing any software, this is the best practice you can follow. Upgrade all the packages using this command yum update. yum update iPhone Y. Okay, so it will take some time. Very first time we are executing this one. So once it is updated, upgraded, again, if you run same command, it is not going to take the time. So very first time only, it will take some time. Let it be. It is the upgrading all the packages. <clears throat> Do you? It will take some time. Very first time we are running this command. <clears throat> so let it uh, upgrade. So you can follow my blog. So this one for other posts. We have many posts we have created related Docker, Kubernetes, Linux commands. Okay. And also I have a YouTube channel also. Just open that YouTube and you can search here with Mithun Technologies DevOps. Okay, you will see that one channel name Mithun Technologies DevOps. Just follow this one. Here many videos also there. Okay. Still it is done. <clears throat> and whenever you are uh, using my videos, if you have any questions, you can reach out to this number or mail id for any technical help we are going to assist you okay, still it is taking it's, it will take some time usually very first time we are doing right that's why It has to reach 450. 268 packages has done. Still, it is. Yeah, almost it is done. It will wait here sometime again. So it is done. So guys, sometimes it will take even two minutes also to upgrade all these packages. Please wait, okay? And uh, if you run same command now, it is not going to take much time. 
because it is already upgraded. Okay. <clears throat> It is saying that dependencies are nothing to do. It is done. So it will take sometimes five minutes also. Okay. So now all the packages are upgraded okay, in your server. Now you have to download that uh, Terraform binary file. So for that one, if you see here, we have one website. You can go to that Terraform website and you can download that one. Select that whatever. So before that, uh, so if you want to download a package in the EC2 instance, any Linux server, we are going to use the wget command. So by default, this wget, unzip, these packages are not installed. So install it. So we are installing now wget, unzip. Okay. So vim command. So it is done. Then you can go to this website. So here I have documented. This is the URL for downloading the Terraform software. Okay. So here, and if you identify which operating system, okay, based on that one, you can take it. So right now we are going to install in the Linux Red Hat Enterprise Linux server, right? So 64 bit, we are using that one. So right click, you can see that copy link location so go to that opt directory usually all the softwares we are going to keep here wget okay download it <coughs> so it is downloaded this package if you want you can check it see now you can extract it and you can extract and you can keep into that uh, users bin directory okay so here see i have unzip okay this particular direct uh, this particular zip file and we are uh, extracting into this particular directory slash usr local slash bin i see just if you execute this command it is going to extract into the current directory but i want to extract into that uh, this particular directory that's why i'm using that i fund d that directory path okay now it is going to extract this particular file into this directory it is done that is what just very simple installing is nothing but the terraform just we'll download this uh, zip file archive file and we are going to extract that zip file into this particular directory now we have successfully installed so after installing if you want to check which version of terraform you have installed just execute the terraform iphone <coughs> v see it will give that which version of Terraform you have installed, or just you can mention that um, Terraform version. It will give that uh, which version of Terraform you have installed. So if you need any help, um, Terraform, iPhone, iPhone, help, you can mention. See, here we have many commands are there. Terraform apply, Terraform test drive, Terraform <coughs> plan, okay, see, many commands are there. So now you have successfully installed Terraform. Please <clears throat> follow my YouTube channel for further videos. Thank you.